Now that we know what seagrasses are and how they grow, let's learn about what they do and why they're important. To help us with this, we'll be talking to another expert who's visited us here at Six Senses Lamu, Dr. Paul York. G'day, I'm Paul, and I'm a marine biologist from James Cook University in Australia. And I study seagrass ecosystems. Seagrasses are hugely important for many different reasons. Just one hectare of seagrass can produce over 100,000 litres of oxygen, enriching the air that we breathe. Seagrass can capture carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and store it in marine sediments up to 40 times faster than tropical rainforests. This makes seagrass a very important tool in the fight against climate change. Seagrass also have very extensive root systems that can stabilise marine sediments, preventing coastal erosion. Seagrass provide a home for a huge number of animals, from very small crustaceans and invertebrates to huge megafauna like sharks and stingrays. Seagrasses are also a nursery ground, protecting baby fish from predators before they grow up and move to coral reefs or the open ocean. And the seagrass itself is a food source for many different animals, including the majestic green sea turtle. As you can see, seagrass is important to many ecosystems and industries. That's why it's so important to protect it. In 2018, we did a survey of tourist resorts in Maldives, and we found that 50% of resorts that have seagrass were removing it. And this was because they thought it was ugly and guests would not like to see it. Following this, Six Senses Lamu decided to protect their seagrass meadows, and we found that our guests loved it. It meant that guests could see turtles and stingrays swimming straight under their villas. These animals would never be there if it was just bare sand. Because of this, the Maldives Underwater Initiative launched a campaign called Protect Maldives Seagrass. The idea of this was to get people to understand the value and importance of seagrass and show that it can be beneficial to tourism. The campaign got 28% of resorts in Maldives to protect their seagrass. This is more than 90 football pitches. Imagine all the wildlife that can live there. Let's have a look at one of those videos that we made for our campaign. It's a virtual reality video, but you can watch it on any device that you have. We made this video to help show people who have never gone underwater to see seagrass just how beautiful and important it is. Once you finish watching that video, it's your turn to come up with a conservation message. It helps people remember it if it's short and creative. If it's positive, it can help inspire them rather than a negative message. Ours is, the seagrass is greener where you protect it. What's a positive message that you can think of to get people to protect the environment? It could be about anything to do with the environment, from protecting seagrass to reducing plastic pollution.